Who's ready to get your fill of risk? I'm Phil. I'm a top grand master playing risk global domination. On my channel, we talk strategy. So for tips, tricks, and techniques, subscribe and follow. I'm going first. This is Classic Capitals. And this one's connected to one, two, three. One, two, three. This one's connected to one, two, three, four, five, six. This one is a decent cap, though. One, two, three, four. This might be where I start. I add two here, fortify in here. That's. I think that's my play. Oh, that's a corner. That's an interesting corner. So, nowhere in the Americas is good. Unless your Arco not recommended. Middle East is amazing on this one. Okay, so Noob, where would you have gone in this situation? Yellow's cap is ridiculous. You like my cap? Okay. I can control pockets. Okay. Good. I was thinking with the blizzards this was, was good. I was thinking either here or Ontario because it's so connected, right? Um, here I thought was okay, and here was okay. Now where do I get a card? Here? Add two and go down. And then fortify this in. Or I could add three, four here and go up and fortify this in. Try to get over here. Then I'm blocked from this direction. I could skip a card. Put myself at the back of the turn order. This blocks me. Okay. I'm blocked with that cap, so I'm hoping to get some troops out of that and then fortify my four in. I didn't lose any troops on that, so I think I'm all right. I think I'm all right here. This is progressive. Progressive cards. Did I say fixed at the beginning? Yellow's eventually going to get punched out of the rest of the board. And then at the right moment, I can card block them and take North America. I don't ever want to cl close myself this way, I don't think. Towards Europe. I think I gave my standard YouTube intro. Hit one of my twos. I mean, they're they're there for the hitting. I don't see why you wouldn't. You could also hit that one. I'd fortify the three on the two, maybe? Something like that. Because I won't want to block myself. Black probably moves stuff into their capital. Pink's going to have a, a decent early game. All right, so what did we learn from Yellow's play so far? Yellow, I would say, is probably a newer player blocking their cap like that. They did have turn one South America, so the extra plus two if they plan on being aggressive early is good. Um, I'm hoping to have a one to hit after this turn, but I don't know if I will other than blocking my cap, but I'm already blocked by that other cap, so that might be okay. I don't know if I really want to take North America ever. Okay, they want us, um, Africa. Fair enough. Do we think Red will take Europe? Because if we do, I can move my two in. 
I think we just let black out right now. With black's cap, I can be easily blocked if I take all of North America. Lauren, thanks for lurk lurking. 4 a.m. Wow. Yeah, pink will have a decent early game. We'll see if they block themselves. But they're going to be blocked real soon. I don't really want to unlock Black's cap towards me ever. So yellow and pink will get off to early leads. Yeah, I do want to go for territories outside, but I don't want to hit twos. So I want to have two stacks before I start going for North America. Oh, you're so close to Grandmaster. 17.7k to 25.1k. That's so close. So I'm hoping like pink will hit this one. And then fortify down to the two. So I can hit that one. Yakush. Yakush. Yeah, see, I don't want to hit Iceland. I hit Iceland when it, when I'm desperate or when I'm going for a kill or something. But I don't want to hit Iceland. I don't agree with adding so much out here. I don't think you needed to. I also don't think you needed to hit that one. That made no sense. So... But I think if I hit Ontario, Black will leave. What does Black want? North America? Yellow one, unlock Black in a few rounds anyway. Yeah. Should I add two to my eight until it's gone? Yeah. Uh, you don't need to hit twice. They slider blitzed one and got him down a troop. Interesting. Okay, purple. Who are you? Need a noble fist. Interesting. So I think I give red a card. They should hit up. Let them connect their troops or go back up. They could have connected their troops last time. They could connect their troops different ways. I think I'm okay. I want to be at the top. I want to have one, two, three, four, five places to hit around me. Basically, I want to I want to use an outside army with some of my income for quite a while. So then I have a lot of troops to take in North America so that I don't get card blocked or I don't have to come through Europe. So this is my style thing, but I try to add external to cap as it makes my cap smaller when they get taken out. What do you mean? You have like a big stack outside and your cap smaller?
make your cap as big as possible every turn. Yeah, I get that. Just keep hitting in North America is what you're saying. Everything back into cap. I could start doing that. I could waste these outside troops and then go everything back into cap. That's an interesting, yeah, that's an interesting idea. Because I will have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven at least, and then probably eight, nine, depending on what yellow does. And then I'll have ten. So I'll have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight at least to hit. After this stack is gone. And then people will probably hit in here. Like yellow will probably have to hit in here. Bigger chance of being noob slammed. I really like this spot. I I think I don't know if Pink's gonna consider hitting it or not, but I like it. No one's being too dumb right now. Yellow is the easiest to kill because of the, they have the least on cap. I could go here for a turn now. Mongolia, let them connect and then come back up. Okay. So you don't worry about external troops until you have to. Punch out and get them. That's interesting. These games do take a long time. I'm ho I hope I get another one. We're t everyone's teaching her to play too much. Yeah, we are. Punching red out of here is an interesting idea. Black's an aggressive player. They'll probably punch me out at some point, right? Yeah, I'll be able to trade with yellow until the cows come home, probably. Until I decide to block them. Because if they don't play nice with me, then they're just done, right? I don't feel incentivized to take yellow out right now, though, to be honest with you. Because their biggest stack is facing me is probably the biggest reason. If yellow hits me, everybody else gets a turn before yellow, which is not good. But no one's stack can reach me. So conceivably, yellow could hit me and I'd be all right. But I, I, I do agree. Like, I probably need more on this cap. Wherever they fortified it there. They definitely want to connect their troops. So I'll just hit here. I'm worried that this incentivizes black to hit my sixth. I don't usually card skip. Though I've been thinking about it a lot more in progressive caps. Because I have played games where people like just j just outpace me because of um, not, not have, or just because of the trade order. I could always card skip next time. Yeah. Yellow card skipped. Hit the two of yellow.
I don't generally card skip in regular progressive though. I want to be I want to be early in the turn order, so in the second set of trades, I can at least stay alive and give myself a fighting chance. I'd hit the one. That's what I thought was going to happen. That's why I didn't want to leave that too weak. I think I, I think I do use this stack to get just add to there and get a card because right now cards are super important. I could card skip after this turn. Still, too. Similar result. They're going to hit yellow. No, they didn't hit yellow. Why hit me and not yellow? Why stack on me as well? They're going to hit that stack, but that's fine. I need the cards. And if they hit just the one, then I'll take another card. I'll take cards here. Wherever I can. Have a good night, Lark. Yeah, they could have been on my cap. If no one hits this yellow one, ever. Well played, they say. Are they talking about the card skip? I don't understand why that yellow one wouldn't be the next thing you hit. There you go. Now yellow and I are codependent. Yeah, big enough to not get taken out by a noob. I agree. So was it a bad idea to card skip because there's a 28 here? Who knows? Punching pink out. So pink has to get blocked. Interesting. I don't hate it. Black is very aggressive. If one person decides to hate black, that's the end of the day for them. Yeah, add external first. I like to add external first. This is a little tip too. So you never accidentally roll a 3v1. But the good hair, thanks for the rate of 26 viewers. Thank you. Awesome. Polygunner, I never noticed your follow. Sorry. If you're still here. But thank you for the raid. How was your stream? I think I leave this three. Because if I hit anywhere, I block my cap from coming out. Yeah, you're in a rough space now. Black is somewhat weak, but they're going to survive. Hey, Sebi. 
It was good. Some games didn't work. Server issues. Played Battleship with Snakes. Oh, awesome. Yellow and me have to trade now, so we're just we're just cool. Hey. You and I are cool. We're the coolest of cool. They don't think they can win this, do they? They're not a noob that thinks they can win this, are they? So I don't unlock their stack. I take cards here. Okay. Ooh. We're just codependent. Nobody has a stack that can hit me. Unless somebody purposely feeds me. They want black to hit here or here. Black set up so that paint can be card blocked. They hit this three. They're gonna leave the five there, so I have to either block myself. Yeah, I, that three is just gone. Purple trades kills red. Interesting kill. Doesn't trade again. Pink goes and kills purple. Hmm. There's a big opportunity here. Pink should kill purple and take these caps, I think. They should not have enough to kill me after this. Do I have enough to kill Black? Black has 40, only 25 on cap. I need a 50 to hit that. They're going to be big. The trades are at 30, 35. Now Pink's in a really good situation. I definitely trade, I think. I mean, I don't have to. No one has a big enough stack facing me to kill me. Fortify onto your cap, right? Okay. Um, do I have to trade? Thirty-five. You can put ten here and thirty here. That's a sixty-nine. Good job. All right. Yeah, that was good. That was good. 
I had to think about it. But then I was like, that's 100%. I'm pretty sure that's 100%. Now I can choose to card block one of them. I can card block yellow easily. Just never, just never hit yellow. I think yellow is the easier card block because otherwise I'd have to block here and here and then hit yellow. Pink's maybe the. I don't know. Hey, let's be cool. I could card block both at once. Why would you card block pink? That's an interesting thought. Yellow does seem like a noob. Just give pink the world. Shoot. Well, I didn't add correctly, so. What did I just lose on that roll? Four. Hey, Saeed, how are you? I think I trade with yellow. I don't know. I mean, both of them picked interesting caps. What do you plan on doing with that? Unlocking my cap. Interesting move. This could be like an 80 something. I have the power though, right? Yeah, eventually if I give them one card each every two turns, I outgrow them. I think that's my plan. Every other turn, I'll grow them. Yeah. Trades are fifty five. They would get a lot. Watch them take it now. I'm going to I'm going to trade with yellow cuz I think I want to I think I want to kill pink. That's what I think I'm going to do. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep this above one trade. And then I'm going to keep this the stronger cap and I'm going to trade with yellow. 
and I'm going to slowly card block pink. Yeah, I have, the, I have the jump on yellow in the 1v1. Yeah. Yeah, I think so too. They're preparing for a cap hit. They could have like 70, 160 on to hit this cap. It's not impossible, especially with cap rolls the way they are. Does yellow know what's happening is an interesting question. They're going to hit it now. Good luck. They might be able to get this. They didn't. Do they fold? If they don't put a bunch of troops over here, I don't need to put a bunch of troops over here. I can add one here and add them, put them here. Okay, where are we at troop wise? Cards are at 65. And pink's going to be card blocked. Okay, good. Do we think yellow should let this happen? They, they go take my cap. Their play might be go take my cap. Yeah, their play might. That might be their play. They might know it. Shoot, I should have traded, man. I didn't have a trade. I didn't have a trade. Fifty-four. I would trade now. How much are you going to fortify over? Not enough. I'm going to go take that right back. I'm going to go through and take it right back. I think that was a good play. I think they should have just fortified everything over there. Who has a trade? They both have trades. Yeah. Well, what was that about? You don't split there. You just fortify everything. You got so lucky. I know. I know. I got lucky. This is a lucky situation for me. And quite frankly, I think I trade to fortify my caps. Because do they hit them again? 75. Do they have? Do they have another option other than hitting my cap? I think I trade early.
Yeah. I could keep it weak to bait them. Right, for the moment I'm winning the game, but they're going to trade. Trades are at 80. 120. Pink's card block, but they have four cards. When I get strong enough, I'm going to card block both of them. You don't have enough to take a cap. Yeah, the Greenland cap is pretty cool. The Asian cap is pretty good, too. They really don't have to do anything. Trades are if I'm I'm thinking 120, 130, yeah. I'm thinking that pink has cards and they're trying to save them till they can hit this. But it's possible pink doesn't have cards. Trading now doesn't help them any. I'm never unlocking yellow. Every troop I put on that cap is like one and a half troops on average they need. Yeah, man. Got kind of lucky. Yellow didn't get a fortify off. Otherwise, we'd be in a game again. The game would have opened it up for pink, but would have also opened it up for yellow. I don't really need... Do I even need to trade? No, I don't need to trade. 85. So they get like 100, 145. They shouldn't win that roll. Pretty soon... We're going to outpace purple here. Or we're going to outpace pink. They're getting 24, but pretty soon we're going to outpace them. Interesting. At this moment, I could card block them both. I'm not ready to do that yet. Where it's a mutual card block, they win, but that's very unlikely. Safety seems better. 
Well, I figured if they hit me, they lose a bunch of troops. Yeah, pulling off cap. A bit, so eventually I can pull here, 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 here. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then I can maybe add stacks here to card block yellow, card block them both. Blocking my caps. So. Yeah. Pink stain in the game. Good without a, without a wild. And we'll put like fifty here, and the rest here. And you really just need like twenty fives to do that. So I yeah, I could eventually card block them both. It would be interesting and then they would start teaming on me. Yeah, they're too far ahead for this plan to work. Yeah, I think so. I think I need I think I need a lot of time to pass before I do that. Yep, yeah, right now my plan is just to trade with yellow. I have a wild. I hope to never use it. Pink is stuck on four cards. Yellow, we really just need the turns. If I were yellow, after you try that, I would just fortify up and likely suicide on both your caps. Yeah, probably true. Game okay, of capital. I'm. Yoder's in an interesting game, and he's writing about it. Hey, Nuke, how are you doing, man? I haven't seen you around as much lately. You're probably around, just not here. We just keep doing this. Don't add them all there. Yeah. Trading after yellow is good. Yeah, we're getting the same troops. If yellow gets tired of this and pulls his stack out, that's interesting. No, we don't want to trade a wild. 104. For some reason, I like the Greenland cap better. Don't know why. Eventually, I could advance this hold all the way here to Middle East. Begging, yep, this got to hit me, but then I give up this one. Mm, I don't think I'll do that. 
Not on risk much. You tend to miss you when you're streaming anyway. Yeah. Well, I, I didn't stream very much for a long time, so it was probably me that was not around. It'd be funny if Pink was holding cards the whole time. I've basically hijacked the game and kept it in this state because this state is good for me. So. Leech a little. Yeah. So what Leech Little is saying is this 173 should probably come off and like face one of my caps. Um, they probably will do something like that because they'll probably get bored. And then yellow might end up playing with them and then I lose my advantageous position. Yeah, if they both max face the same cap, then I ha I'm, this position is over and I have to decide to do something else. But they have to work together, and alliances are not on. Card values are never going to be enough to hit my cap. Yellow's still in the lead, so they might just figure they can fortify up when it's time to go, when it's go time. And when pink bots, I can just take cards off the pink bot and maneuver around that way. You want to redeem a hydrate? Where was that three at? On one of my caps. If yellow hits a cap and leaves me unlocked, then conceivably I could kill them. Where's your hydrate? I mean, this state is good for me. I'm trading after yellow, getting five extra troops a turn, which eventually catches me up with them. I have pink blocked. I have two of the better caps in the game. Middle East cap's probably the best. All my troops are on cap. Yep, yeah, if pink bot unbalanced bliss, if pink bots, I card block yellow. Pink has shown no signs of body. And I can even hit the bot. Like I can like go into the bot and hit the bot. Giving them cards and such. Without that stack unlocked, they can't do anything to me. And that stack is there to protect their South America claim. Do I have a trade without 
Yeah, I have a tray without using a wild. Do they eventually bot? Nope, they're never going to bot. They're going to sit in this state forever. Yellow now only has 24 troops on me. Their stack is not big enough to hit me without a trade. If they pull it out, I could trade and keep their stack in. I could take a hit and still be in the game. So we've reached a state of where it's very hard for me to lose this game without getting, like, teamed on. Yeah, move all your troops to the 197 cap slowly, and then move all those troops somewhere to threaten me. That's probably their move. If I misclick and unlock yellow, they'll probably come into me. Because they tried to take this um, camp check and cap earlier and just failed to roll. Hope I go for a different cap. Yeah, I won't. I don't care about their caps. I can keep this up if yellow bots as well. Greenland, not Kamchatka. Yeah, Greenland was the cap I chose. Honestly, I think the way this game ends is one of them bots and I card block the other one. General Cobbler and General Basic. Basak. It's funny. Yeah, so I like the Greenland cap better too, and that's why I'm protecting the Greenland cap. Be very careful to hit the right territory. Because if I hit the other territories, I unlock yellow, and then the game's wide open again. What are trades at? 125. They're only at 125. Now I have to use my wild though, which kind of hurts because it, it was nice insurance and it gives it back to other people. Yellow. Yep, they plan on just doing this forever. They're fine with me crushing, blocking pink. Oh, you're right. Boosted boots. Thank you. Hey, Arco, what's up? <laughs> I'll have to figure that out in the morning. Yeah.
All right. Yeah. It's so funny that I, Arco doesn't care that everyone said Arco sucks. Arco is a very good player. I got fourth in my last game. I got double tapped, basically. Just boom, boom, double tapped. Late in the game. I picked a bad cap spot, to be fair. But I got my I had my cap double tapped and then the person killed me instead of the person that tapped their cap first. And it fed my it fed them five cards for cheap and probably the win. Take the gamble here as yellow gets eight hundred the truth those next turn. Turn it turn in and hit it. Yeah, I might turn it if I were them. Well, you could you could place it in a way that you could hit either stack. So if yellow hits here, fortifies out, turns in, they could hit either stack. They're turning in early. Well, I mean, you might as well, right? Watch them do exactly what I just said. I think I, I think I forgot to put it in Northwest Territory last time too, to ensure I can only hit one area. game is going on a long time. Yellow takes a while for their turns. They're like they're considering something. Yeah. Yeah, and then le they could leave the other cap blocked as well. They have a move. They also aren't making these fours. They're making these eights. When will we see them get fed up with the game? Pink's still here. Getting a bunch of troops. Not worried about being card blocked. Oh, I was I scrolled a lot on that one. Yeah. In this situation if you're pink if you're yellow, you probably try to open up the game. And if you're pink, you probably just leave the game. Yeah, I would think that's what you do. Like, Pink could have acted earlier and moved everything next to my caps, but they didn't. Do I have a trade? I do.
103. See if they fortify back down. <laughs> this game, man. I mean, I can almost kill pink, but like yellow will be able to punch out even if it's not the first turn. They have 600 on cap. I have over 1,000 on cap. I can almost kill pink, but it's not ever going to be worth it. I think I want these more even. All right, I'm going to fill my water bottle. Hang out, everybody. Abo Irab, thank you for the follow. I'm back. Nothing interesting has happened. No one's deciding to push the envelope. And everything's going well for me. I've almost caught up to yellow just by getting bigger trades than them. Pink bot? Pink hasn't bought it. Yeah. It's almost getting too late for yellow to try the, the move they could have done. Like, they shouldn't win these, these hits anymore. So... Now you can take them. But you won the game, Yoder? Good job. You win, Peter. Noob says they went and picked up their daughter from school and came back thinking he was missing something. And he came back to the same board state, basically. Let's see if they go offline. No, they're still here.
I could start trading with pink in a few turns. And just block yellow. Then yellow slam is one of my caps, right? If yellow ever trades on four again, I could also card block them. Here, 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 and here. Or here, 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 and here. Pick a card. I mean, this board state favors me the most. When the board state favors you the most, how long do you stay in that board state? The answer is probably forever, right? Eventually I have the kill in pink, but that's like a hundred turns from now. Pink has fallen considerably behind. They're just waiting for something to happen. Now they're stalling out their turn. They're using it as a strategy to get us bored. Because what, what Pink really needs is for us to be bored of the, the board state, bored of the board state, and start hitting each other. They need time, right? It's yellow that's probably going to get antsy. I would, yeah, I would abandon every cap but one if I were Pink. And then consider moving that po position. One sixty eighty. I just messed up there. Hopefully yellow doesn't see that as me trying to have them open me. Mm -hmm. Pink's still in the game. Interesting. It's the four. I don't blame them. I don't blame them for hitting that four. I don't really care. I've slowly caught up to yellow. They were quite a bit ahead of me by getting five extra troops a turn. I'm just doing this to get slowly make the caps even. He refused to take the bot out. <laughs> he cornered the bot to kill them. You manipulated the bot to kill somebody, Nuke. That's funny. Hmm. Alrighty. Pink's probably watching a movie now, just like, okay, well, we'll see how this game ends. I I don't have a trade right now, so luckily I didn't need one. Try to make my turns 10 or 15 seconds just so we can get the rounds over with. Yellow and pink are taking a while, though. Thank you, Yoder, for caring about watching. Thank you.
Yeah, he should have put pressure on me immediately. What Pink should have done is be, is taken one card only and then started fortifying to one cap only in the middle, one of the middle caps, and then when it was too late for them, fortified off to one of my caps. Is yellow going to bot first? That would be interesting. Nope, they were probably just going to the bathroom or something. Hmm. Interesting card skip there. Interesting card skip there. Still in the game. He can leave his cap unlocked if I hit. So I think I have to hit pink. I think I skip too. That's an interesting idea. I think I skipped too. Yeah, you're right. I think I skipped too. Unless pink bots. No, he's just wasting his whole, he's offline now. Do we believe Pink's going to stay gone? I think I come through here and take all this. Put like 90 here. And the rest here. And I come through and I take all this. Watch Pink come back in the game. Still offline. They need to fortify out now. They come here and fortify out. And I need and I need them to get a bad cap roll. All right. Pink's irrelevant now. Pink's just behind me. I hit as many easy cards of pink as I can to try to get easy cards in the future. That's what I do with my turns. Interesting. But I don't hit big stacks yet. And I think this goes back. I think this goes back. Trades are at 175. So even if I'm hitting I'm trying to do math. <laughs> yeah, right now I'm trying to get the bots to spread out so I don't have to hit super huge stacks. Fortify up. No, you're going to be card block, son. Is just taking Japan. 
taking that much territory you don't think is that good? Did I take too much? Explain to me why. And I'll give yellow third. Oh, look at this. I have to hit a bigger stack, don't I? Hit yellow? Hit yellow here? I don't want to hit a 136. That seems crazy. I think I have to hit yellow one more time. 136 is crazy right now. The bot's not spread out enough. I need to be able to take them at like 60. Oh, reverse card block the bot. Yep. I can reverse card block the bot. Okay. I will. Yeah, I gave him extra troops, so that made it harder. Yellow can see. I can't do it now. That was a really weird fortify. I thought I lost it. Yellow has a slight lead on me. I hit, I'm hitting the bot. It's just slower. Yeah, I agree. I should have reverse card blocked the bot. Does he go keep going back to the 1100? No way does he keep going back to the 1100. Man. He's really protecting that plus two. I could try to card block him now. With 50s. Look at this, though. Like, getting a card off the bot is really hard.
I think I do this. I just didn't think fast enough. Maybe they don't get a card this turn. Manual roll it. They win it. Green is up to something. Watch out for him. Yep, green is up to something. Yellow never gets another card that's not a 50. They're going to need a trade. They're going to need to come off cap. If I can get a card somewhere else that's not expensive, I will. But oh, I can get that 15. Nope, I can't. What are trades worth? 195? Okay. Aviate and lose three. <laughs> yeah, I know, but eventually this worked. And then I can start hitting bot. I can come through the 141 and down and over and up. They don't have cards? I wonder how much they put right here. They need to put like a lot. So I get a card here. Go through the 282. I mean, I could kill. I could kill pink too, probably. Because they only have like so many on cap. They're going to miss Fortify again. 76, not enough. Eleven sixty nine. I get two hundred. It's not time. I think I maybe should hit the bot instead. I don't know. Oh, look at that. Losing some troops. I think I need to eventually come through and hit this bot. The bot's on four and, and not taking a card. 
Can you fortify them all, buddy? Do I have a trade? No. Eleven sixty nine for two hundred. Yeah, it'd be interesting if they actually fortify a lot off. Nine oh eight. Now I slam their stack. And that'll give me a card. Give them some cards. They haven't been doing what we say. Which one? If they unlock my cap, I should. Do I hit him? You have to unlock my cap. I think I had 50s again and hit him. I kill yellow. If they hit my cap, I can. This is a mistake. I think I hit the 659 too. What are trades at? 205? How was that roll? It doesn't seem like it was that good. Oh, that was a great roll. 495 to 659. They shouldn't take more than one card. Bot is interesting. I can still kill the bot, but it's not worth it.
Oh, I want to put some on that 8 so they couldn't get another card. They can still 8v8. Shoot. They can still 8v8. It's not, it's not a terrible situation for them. Okay. Cards? No. I leave them blocked. And I start attacking through the bot. Off-cap troops. Okay. The bot's the strongest. I think I just give the bot... I can't card... I can't reverse card block the bot, I believe. I don't have enough. I need the bot not to hit this, right? Hmm. Will the bot hit this? Don't do that! Is the bot going to hit it? Oh no, it's going to take my cap. It's going to take my cap. Oh no. Oh no. I didn't even notice, guys. I didn't even notice. Oh no. I need to trade trade and kill the bot now, maybe. I don't... Oh no. I got I got fatigued. I got fatigued. No. Oh, how do I win this game now? All right. Well, I totally forgot. Look away, everybody. I was playing so well. Well, good game. That bot rolls that cap. I just gave away the game, probably. So bad. So bad. Reg is really disappointed. And it wins. It wins. I just gave away the game. I mean, the game's not over. But come on. I can come down here. Take the cap back. Oh, man. It was all on purpose. It was all on purpose. I can't believe that. <laughs> A little bit I can. A little bit. It just happened. He can take this cap, too. I hit here, and then 4 or 5 back. I mean, it might hit my 250.
their move to the Middle East. It's a, it's an interesting move because if they fail this roll, then they don't get a card. Yes. Now yellow takes the cap. Yeah, now yellow takes my cap. But then yellow are not yellow. Pink. Pink probably rolls his cap. But I can survive from here. I can play inside of the bot. I can come in here and, and do some stuff. Go to like the Middle East cap or something. Yeah, this cap. It just did. And gives yellow cards. Now yellow can go take that cap. I could switch caps. Switch caps, punch yellow, leave enough here that they can't get a card. Yeah, I think that's what I do. Wow, that was costly. That was costly. Did I go the wrong way around? The bot will kill me, you think? I don't think the bot's killing me. I don't think the bot's going to hit that many territories. I think I've misplayed. I think I've gotten too fatigued, like my brain is gone. What I'm hoping is the bot does not hit this cap. If this guy comes back, he wins the game. The bot hits that cap. All right. No, it went that way. Yeah, I absolutely misplayed this game.
I absolutely misplayed it, guys. What you're looking at is somebody who misplayed a game. I could have ended this thing. I don't know what I was doing. I got fatigued. It should be like all of them. What are trades at? 235. Can I hit that and keep it? Do I need to just cap stack for a while? I mean, I can hit this 119 if pink opens me. My cards might be costly here. You do this when you're not tired? In Iceland. Iceland's interesting. Iceland could get expensive though. I bet they tr I bet they fortify over there. Yeah, Iceland's too expensive. Probably Alaska. Actually, I think I want to hit down to try to get that 85 to fortify. I mean, this is still winnable. The bot's huge. But as long as I can keep a cap, I can cap on the bot later. They still care about South America, which is their big flaw. Yeah, the bot the bot can still get second in this game. The bot can still win this game. I don't hit yellow. Win for who? Win for me. Yeah, I agree. They shouldn't let neutral bots. It's going to be more costly for me to get a card than him. And the, the bot is stacking on me. The bot has four cards. The bot might just kill me, right? It's going to have like 500 there. And I slider blitz error. Oh, the bot is stacking on me more than him. I might just lose to the bot. No set on four. The bot does not know what it wants to do. Okay. It did not decide to kill me. But my card is going to be expensive.
I think the bot will card block him if I tr if I go over here to this cap. And it's a big hit, but I have to hit a 65 or a 91. Yellow can go take that cap now. He would kill me with a trade, maybe. Yeah, I put myself in a really bad spot. The 356 is very intimidating. I can own Europe or own Asia with two caps. A lot of troops to hit, though. I don't think I'd do it. Don't come all the way over, dude. Split. Split, dude. Are you kidding me? Yes. Middle East cap. Middle East or Greenland. I think I go back to Greenland for now. The bot is just chasing me down. I think I need to I think I need to Middle East it because it it wants North America. I'm just, I'm just, yeah, you need to be able to kill yellow and then cap run when the time is right. He's taking the Greenland cap. Hopefully the bot fortifies back over. Watch this bot just follow me. He's all right. Like, he's not lost this game. Like, down here. And then through here. This bot is just going to follow me right into here, right? Look at this. It followed me exactly. It's just following me. All the bot is doing is following me. And it has four cards, and they're worth 250 I didn't split, so it didn't split. No, I don't have a set. Don't give it more cards. Want it trade and hit me? 
Egypt? Why Egypt? I cannot believe this bot is on me like this. This yellow player loves the South American cap so much. It's the wrong cap to love. Now they have the upper hand on me. I better have cards. I do. I, I can take Greenland. Yeah, that's an option. But the bot just keeps following me and following me and following me. The bot followed me. The bot followed me all the way through here to here and then down to here. Okay, so I need to not go in a straight line. Split a bit as I go. Interesting. Okay. I gotta be honest, 700. I was close to a cap run. Bots at 602, it's trading. Trades are 260. Is it going to stack on yellow like it stacked on me? Watch it not come all the way into me. Okay, it came into me. I can get a card. Yellow's cards are cheaper.
How is Green still going? Green had a couple of turns where he messed up big time. So, I don't know. I won't get cards by doing that. We'll see. I have a trade. Yellow could block me. Yellow could come here and block me. That's their move. Split troops there. I'm not any level. Like, this game, I just totally messed up. I think I need to take one card and pass, right? That's what I need to do. Take a card and pass. And let the game let the game go. And hopefully the bot. There we go. What did open say? That he likes fixed caps better. How do I win this game now, guys? That one turn, man, it was the worst thing. The North America, South America hold is not that big of a deal, but those caps are good. That's a big deal. Well, they're having to hit bigger stacks than me at the moment. That's something. Be funny if Pink came back in the game. I'm obviously not better. The problem is I got very, very fatigued. Every time I play late at night, like I make an error. And I only play late at night. So now the bot's being good to me. But man, I let the bot hit me so hard. Oh. Children. Children. Bye, Yoder. Have a good night. I'm determined I'm going to win this game. You don't like fixed caps.
It wants to take Europe back and try to take Asia. So it's going to keep stacking on the Asia border. There we go. I, you need to learn how the pot moves. I do. Trying to pay attention right now. Eighteen that time. We're in a stalemate. Don't they, shouldn't they hit that 99 at some point? You leave troops off cap. I can't hit them. Yeah, they should probably open up behind this bot. Do it for me. That 416 might move. Ooh, interesting. The bot can't hit him. With a trade, will it hit him? Maybe. It might hit him. Oh, I'm glad they won that 2v1. All right. I win this by letting Yellow screw up, and they will. They were screwing up before by letting me get them in a car block situation. I just messed it up by by the, that fortify. That fortify killed me. So the bot is going to go block in the three twenty. So follow both paths. Interesting. It didn't go with the 418. It's still costly for them. The bot has so much on cap that I can't kill the bot either. And now now yellow's blocking the bot kill, which I whatever. They want to get cards in there. They want to farm the the bot in Australia. That is a fundamental from yellow. Yeah, I think so. I think they eventually get hit by being split this much, right? Like, but look at this. Pink's no longer hitting me. 
So I might run out of cards. Yes, add there. Yes. Give me a card, pink. Give me a card, pink. Okay, good. 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 I keep waiting for it to, like, do something to me. The 212 cap? I have to go through a 418, dude. I have to go through a 418 to take the 212 cap. Otherwise, I would, man. Oh, you didn't add there. Now you gotta hit a stack. The bot does not have a trade. I do, but I don't want to use it. Well, I made the game interesting. You think it's worth losing like 800 troops to go to England? I might lose the game if I if I make that play. It would I think it's too many troops. It wouldn't be the first time in history chat suggested a losing strategy. I think it's too many troops. You didn't mean now? Oh, yeah. If this 418 moves, or even goes down to like 100, and I can punch through like 150 and get that to 11, I might do it. And then just like pull 50s off. In the game, how can you tell which countries are capitals? These ones. The ones that look like they're capitals. Here's the problem. I will run out of cards over here. If it does not add over here, I'm going to run out of cards. No, we don't want to trade in the wild. The bot skipped cards. So, the chances are gone. Yeah. Sad Arcos. Just sad Arcos. Man. I'm going to run out of cards unless it tries to take Europe again. Uh, what do I do about that? Give it a card here. I might have to punch through 250 to hit a 550. Hmm. He's not running out of cards the same way I'm running out of cards, though.
Let's do this 258 on him. The bot will not move off that 105. Okay. What are you saying? Let the bot move its soldiers away from the castle. You hit India. Run up to your all, but not hit Siberia. And the bot will move off, and I can get, and the bot will move off. Those lobbies are sick. Eighteen hundred. Okay, it went through. I'm going to live. It, it hurt, but I'm going to live. I honestly feel like if I get opened again, and this is a viable cap, I should take that cap. I keep my VODs up. Oh, you may be asking somebody else. It's only a 538. The bot opens me. I think they, I take this Greenland cap. Ooh, unless it blocks with a ton of troops. Yeah, noob in four hours. Okay. I was like, yeah. I think I needed to go take the Greenland cap. We'll punch right through these. stop there okay using the restroom oh I have 66 viewers everyone hang out I'm using the restroom
Okay, what do we got now? Yellow has to hit a 149. Oh, yellow can hit a 42. What can I do? Um, slowly mess with yellow. I think I'd leave 50s in yellow's area. What are the trades actually? 330? I could leave 500. I don't want yellow. It's not cost fallacy at all. No, I had... His original cap is Brazil. And I had Greenland. Do I want off-cap troops like this? I want this many off cap troops. I don't think so. I think he just slams them and gets a good roll. Yeah, yellow's doing all right. I mean, I I I gave him something I shouldn't have. Ooh. I think I let him take that cap. Here's what I think I do. I think I leave 50s behind. And not super big stacks. Because he's going to hit the troops. I'm fine with losing like 50 troops. Which would be like even maybe, maybe 20 more than him. So... Like, I don't think he knows how to, like, like, I can, I can leave 50, 50, 50, 50, and then enough to stop this, maybe take his cap, and hopefully the bot, like, eventually, like, fortifies some next to him as well. <laughs> Hmm. I think the bot rolls this eventually, dude. This is how I win the game. Okay. I think I end up winning this game. Because I think the bot eventually rolls this. And then I go after the bot. Interesting. Split. Good. Because I have one, two, three, four more cards to hit without hitting a big stack.
These don't even need to be 50, to be honest. I think if you move to the hill, you could lose, Phil. I could. He wants he wants troops there, man. He wants that Brazil cap. Hit the cap. All right, pink. Let's see. It's got more troops than me. Don't split too much. Give him a hard card to get. Yeah, take me out over there. Make all his cards hard. Eventually, I'm going to put a bunch of troops right here in Venezuela. Like, make these cards harder to get than these cards. I don't know if I want his Brazil cap. I, I mean, it's it seems worthless. He's got two bonuses, but I don't think that matters. What are trades at right now? 345. So he's not that much ahead of me. And he has to hit large stacks. He only lost 52 hitting a cap. That's crap. That's crap. Devot is going to trade and hit that cap, though. Yeah, he just, he just loses troops. Didn't add enough to hit him. But man, he's got a lot of troops stacked around that. I have a few more cards not to hit a big stack. Alberta, Ural, Mongolia, Kamchatka. This is fine. See, then I can fortify a lot next to this 203. I mean, if he hits it, good for me, because his cap is weak. You'd be tempted to take the Afghanistan cap? That is interesting. Two caps. Two places to hit bot.
yeah, then they can't do this anymore. I need the Afghanistan cap. I can't let them I can't let them do this anymore. It's worth punching through a thirty eight. And I really just need like six hundred here, five hundred, six hundred something. They don't get the easy cards anymore. Yep, I need to do it. Yep. Two eighty seven rolls. I think you're right. Do I need to take the Afghanistan tap? I don't think I need to take the Afghanistan cap. I think I do this instead. And I fortify some troops here. More than their cap. Do 40. If they roll it, they roll it. Columbia, is this where you told me to take an easy card? Oh, yeah. I think this gets rolled eventually. Like, I think they're misplaying right here. They hit this 241, right? Good. I split here. This needs to be more costly than their least costly card. I think the eight, the eighty might be the play. Because they have easy cards right now. I think the 80 is the play. I think it's something like this. Oh, shoot. All of them. Yeah, I think that's the play. They have more troops than me, but they have to hit such big stacks to get cards. And hopefully I won't. Was that a good roll? 114? Yeah, decent. I think their 248 gets rolled. The pressure might be relieved on that 248. Let's see what happens. It's going to be like a three there. They're going to have an easy card.
I could totally pull this back. Something like this and then pull this back to cap. Yeah. And that's going to be my card for sure. They have the three to hit again. They have an easy card to hit again, which is not good. I wonder if that'll ch change. I have easy cards to hit on them still. How do I make that card hard? I could roll down this Middle East cap by like a hundred. And then the bot would probably roll it. I need to do it after they trade. Um, This needs to be more expensive than the 40, like a hundred. My cards need to be more expensive than the bot, but I don't know, man. He thinks I want this cap. I don't want this cap. I want him to hit the bot. Trade you at three sixty five. Be nice if the bot came off of me over here. Eventually the bot rolls his Middle East cap, and then I can probably block him in here and make him hit bigger stacks. Maybe even on the next trade, the bot rolls his Middle East cap. This isn't even a really a card block. But if the Middle East cap is gone, and I can whittle down this cap, then we can block him through here, or the bot can block him as well. He's like, what is going on here? He could hit all my off-cap troops, and then I'll just reset it up. It's want a card? Hit 100 for it. Card block. Yeah, the problem is...
I still need cards now. Like, every card now is more than 100. Yeah. I mean, I would hit me. 370. Look at how he puts 953 here, like it's a big deal. The bot will not roll him, though. Seventeen, eighteen's probably 100%. Yeah, he can come all the way up here. We'll put... Two hundred here. You don't hit my hundreds, it's so weird. I hope pink trading's beautiful. Then I can eventually have him blocked into the bot somehow. I also could slam like a hundred into it. Well, I had to hit a huge stack if I didn't give him a free card. I can make it a hundred. It's not rolling him. Yeah. Put hundreds around his other. I could put hundreds around at 674. This is frustrating. Yeah, if yellow doesn't add, take yellow out of the bottom of Asia. So the big stacks have to come off. Interesting idea. Fifty's not enough because then he just hits the fifty. But I do think you're right. I hit the twenty six and the big sex has to come off. And then and then we're playing a different game. <sighs> come on, bot. Yeah, we'll see if the bot comes off to get cards now. It loosens the load on me. If I can get cheaper cards than him, that's good. I think the bot will. I think the bot will want to take cards somewhere. Yeah, he added 590 there.
Watch the bot card skip. Well, if the bot ends up card skipping, I can block him into hitting stacks of mine. Right here. I can move my 400 off and leave 100 behind or something. I have a question. Since he's a heavy in troops, why doesn't he attack your off cap troops? Yeah, he. I. I just figured he wouldn't. And he didn't. Taking the bot out of Asia is costly. I don't think it's the right move either. Yeah, I just figured he wouldn't and he didn't. What do I need to get this down to? So if I get this down to three hundred, he will not hit a hundred. I will back up. I will back up when it starts behooving me. I hit that spot now. I might have to hit a 109. I might have to hit a 109. Ahmed, thanks for the follow. Oh, and Gold Choro followed as well. Andre gave me 100 bits 26 minutes ago and I didn't see it. Okay. Now I have to hit a 112. He's got the bot completely inside of him. With the bot stacking here and all this ground for the bot to hit, I should eventually have less cards than him, but he's going to hit me instead of the bot. W follow for W streamer. BRB.
Oh, he hit two spots. Nice. He hit two hundreds. That's good for me. Then I don't have to hit the bot this turn. Nice. Yeah, I agree. I could smack some of his, his troops. Leave him blocked. I might do it with the next trade. I was thinking about that earlier. Like I could smack Greenland and and Middle East. Just And then the bot might take those from him. And then I might have him blocked in. These. I messed this game up so bad earlier. Okay. Should fortify here. Dude. I have to hit a stack somewhere. 120. That's a stack I hit. No, that's the stack I hit. See, they fortify to it. Okay. So, if I slam into this, they're going to lose 50, 100, 150. And then if I slam 300 into this, we can try it. That wasn't enough. Let's put 300 into this one. I didn't lose enough on that. Let's see what they do with that. It's costly. I don't think I got good rolls. What I want is to block this 1100. Oh, it would have? Well, let's not give it another territory to hit then. He's going to bot out. No, I'm just going to be playing bots. Is he gone? He's still here. He skipped a card. He needs a 75% rollish. So no more cards for the bot. What if I hit the bot? How much do I need to pull off? 
Trades are at 410. I just hit them here, right? I think the bot rolls one of these. He likes that he likes that cap so much. That's the worst cap. Come on, bot. Roll one of the caps. Trade and roll. Trade and roll. Okay. There we go. There we go. It worked. Gotcha. He still has 2,000 troops. I don't need to do anything to that. That's just going to roll on its own. I just need to pull enough off cap to... All of them. I don't need this cap. They only have two cards. If I pull 150 off, it can't hit me, right? Okay. Good. Good. Venezuela is interesting because it unleashes the 1,032. It's going to reinforce the 509. That's the point of least resistance. If it hits the 509, I block in the 1,000. And then we're playing the cheapest card game. It might not take a card this turn. Maybe I want to give the bot cards. I think I want to give the bot cards. No, it pulled off. Okay. I, that 936 is my enemy. And 936 is going to be a problem. I need to get the bot to hit it after it hits yellow down below. Go hit my 51. Don't block the bot. Yeah, I think blocking the bot's the wrong call. I 
I think the bot needs to get bigger. Yeah, let's give the bot card so it hits one of these stacks. Four thirty. I think that's the key to victory is to give the bot cards. Where it trades at 435. Just hit pink, let them be blocked. Is black green from <laughs> the key to victory is black green from getting cards in NA. That is the key to victory. Did I give yellow another card? Yeah, these aren't too bad. Forty three, I think. I hit one more territory. The slider. You guys really want to see me hit yellow. I'll hit him on a trade. No, I moved around so the bot would do this. Like, to be fair, I moved around so the bot would do this. Like, I had to reposition myself very hard a couple of times. Okay, now I think I slam yellow and hope the bot hits them for harder than I'd lose. Do I hit all their offcast troops? I'd hit the 17 and slam yellow. And don't give the bot a card. Can't card block yellow. Oh. Can I card block yellow?
We can make yellow hit 100. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. He can double tap that. He didn't notice. He didn't notice. If I can get him, if I can get him card blocked, that would be cool. I need to add more here. If you hear here, and then I'll fortify over. Hit something and fortify over. Hopefully, I have an easier a card that's not super expensive. Oh, he can't even get a card here. One thirty. We'll see if he has cards. We'll see if he has cards. Okay. Do I have this game now? Do I have this game now, guys? Let's see if yellow has cards. No cards for yellow. I can fortify off. Slam and fortify off. I need more on this this one here. I need to take a card though. Let's see what purple pink does. Pink might give him a card. Zero them down. I, well, I can't. I don't have enough troops to zero them down. Oh, these other. Yeah. I'm not going to make it. I didn't make it. They get one more card. I'll just reset it up. Do I have cards? No. I have to attack my 408. Shoot. No way did they do that. No way did they just do that. Yeah, 
Yeah, he'll probably set on four, but then I just set it back up. Ooh. Interesting. Will the bot hit that cap? think I hope the bot doesn't hit that cap yeah if he has cards on four he gets reblocked on two cards Exactly. I just keep him card blocked forever. He has to hit the 598 eventually. My 416 is my next card, I think. Do I have cards? I have cards. Four fifty four cards are worth four fifty. I have a fifty nine. I can hit it. I don't think I can card block in this turn, though. The game is two hours longer over one mistake. I agree with you. I think this is what we do. Oh, man. It's a zero percent. Let's see, fortify. Off cap. I hit that. Hit this, fortify over. Don't make it hard for me, dude.
Well, let's see. I didn't get a card, guys. I didn't get a card. This is all for nothing if I don't get a card. Okay, another mistake. It's fine. I'm good, though. I'm still good. I'm in a better position. It's just, I keep making my life harder. I keep making my life harder. Because I'm so tired. It's 1 a.m. now. This is good. The bot probably hits his cap. Is he even going to get the fourth fight off? 191. So if I get a card, I can I can do it again. It's going to hit his one and unleash him. Pink is a bot. As long as I get cards, I'm okay. I think I should really move everything to that other cap, but it's so costly every time. I mean, it's a toss-up which cap it hits, right? It's going to hit the bot. I have cards. It didn't hit the 40. He forgot the 40. Yeah, I need to give Afghanistan up for sure. I think it hits that 667 before it hits my 713, though. Yellow takes it, then they're messing with the bot, right? Oh my gosh. Oh, this is that's so frustrating that it just did that.
Oh man, it's gonna hit me, isn't it? It's gonna hit me. The Afghan cap, I need to give it up. If it doesn't get hit this turn, I'm giving it up. I'm coming through the top. There we go. He gave it a card. Just let the bot stack on him. Yeah. Come on, Bob, be my homie. Okay. Give me a path. Fortify over there, smaller cap. Yes. I don't think we give this up. Not at this point, we don't give it up. Because it's a larger cap than this one, and he could come out and take this cap instead. Oh! Oh! Mm -hmm. I misclicked. Ugh. Guys, I'm so fatigued. I'm so fatigued. How did he get a card? Oh, he had a card there. Does he not see this cap? He's coming through this way to take that cap. Oh my gosh, I misclicked. I hate myself so much. I hate myself so much. That's not enough. I mean, I just have to take that cap back. Does the bot have cards? Is it going to hit me? Yeah, I just take it back. It's costly, but it doesn't end the game. The turn order is wrong to... You son of a bee. It's going to hit it. That was so costly. Cost me 150 troops. He can come here. Okay, I think the bot will eventually fortify back towards his caps if I leave one big cap anyway. I 
I start putting 50s on the on them again. I'm dumb. Like you can watch me right now and say, "Oh, this guy is dumb." He can have that cap. I can have that cap. Man, he's already got three caps. Like I I don't think I need lots of caps. Yeah, there's Australia would be interesting. Australia would be an interesting play. I think that 847 needs to move first. But I need to, I do need to get him out of Australia. It should roll his cap now. I should win this game now. Should roll this cap. Now you're dead. That A forty seven still wants to stack on my fourteen hundred though. If it breaks this fifty, I could probably take him out of here. See, I could lose 1,200 on this and 300 on this. Yeah, I see the cap run too. I just don't think, I just don't, it's not 100% and I think I've got the game won. If I have a trade, I think I I think if with a trade, I think a cap run. I know, I've been working. <laughs> Let's see what the bot does. I think I can kill yellow. 1400 to kill 650, almost all on cap though.
68 there, that sucks. Right now, I'm going to take Australia. Oh, I didn't get the fortify off. Yeah, I think I'd go for the kill. Do I have a cut trade? No. I want to see if he'll hit my cap here. I mean, I have this now. The bot closes in on him here. But now I'm going to have to punch through something big, probably, too. He's going to bot out because he's lost. He must not have a trade. Yeah, he's going to bot out because he lost. This was a long, long game. Oh, he did have a trade. He's offline, though. Okay, cool. Lost connection to the game. He's still botted, though. Okay. You guys still here? Do I still have you? Man, this bot really wants to hit me. Yeah, I'm relieved. I'm relieved. I'm going to have 100% here in a little bit. I need to get some sleep. It's 1.30. I need to make one thumbnail for tomorrow, and I'm good. Just wait till I have a cap run. So take that cap. There's 130. I have to punch through 200. It's 97. I could add here to get this. Add the rest here. I should be able to get those two. Depending on what the bot does. I should have a cap run right now. I could wait one more turn, too. The bots are hitting each other's caps and stuff. Go through the 277. Yeah, I have it through here. Straight down. I have a cap run. Let's see what it does. 
Even through the 118, I have a cap run. Okay. What's the path of least resistance? This is the path of least resistance. I got him in a bad spot and he finally gave up. Oh my gosh, guys, I made so many errors. I honestly, I, I just get really fatigued and I, I had a hard day of work. Like, I, I know it's an excuse, but I was not playing like I can play. Uh, master, intermediate, beginner, and novice, intermediate. So that was a master. All right, subscribe and follow.